Hey boys and girls, Moon Girl here, and this is going to be a general reading for the sign of Pisces. Hi Pisces, hope you guys are doing well and are in the best of health. So you know the drill, it is a general, it may or may not resonate with you guys. If it does, awesome. If it doesn't, just throw it out, just means they weren't meant for you this time. Hopefully next time they will be. And uh, you can always book a personalized reading. Please head to my Facebook like page, Moon Girl Tarot and more, where I'll be giving a daily reading on there, and also a daily reading on my Instagram, Lily Moon Goddess 11 So I would really appreciate you guys supporting following both of those and please support me here on youtube moon girl terror more so would appreciate the subscription and um feel free to swap energies if it's not used the person you're dealing with if you'd like to bless my channel you can through facebook pay or cash app moon girl 11 11 so let's just get started okay okay pisces what is it that you are waiting on i feel like you're waiting on something you've been patiently waiting now you're kind of like antsy about it let me know in the comments what you're waiting for. I feel like this, I'm going to hurry kind of thing. Like, hurry up. I want to get the ball rolling. So I do feel like there is a bit of stagnation. I'm not going to lie. There is stagnation, but it does not mean it's not going to happen. I just feel like this is all in divine timing, okay? Uh, and it's a blessing in disguise here for you. It's like the world, the universe is giving you... Um, uh, buying you time to get all your ducks in a row anything you need to sign and give you time to look uh, over it make sure you've dotted all the I's you crossed all the T's everything like that okay so it's all in divine timing it doesn't mean it's not gonna happen it just means it's gonna take a while here I do feel not now not now not now it's not the right time okay so again this is a blessing in disguise so do not get discouraged by Pisces okay I do see something good coming towards you something you want it's just gonna take some time you are being protected by the 5d and you are being guided okay so let me get some love oracles for you guys here this is with love so i feel like some of you have been married before some of you have been married more than once um, and it didn't work out. Some of you might have even been married or in a situation ship like common law, whatever, with the same person more than one time. Um, I do feel a sense of needing to heal from this. I feel like it really did a number on you and your self-esteem. I also feel like for some of you, you do have abandonment issues and it could have been stemming from childhood. And then when you got with this person, and I feel like this is past energy actually, um, I feel like maybe they abandoned you or you felt a sense of abandonment from them and it just kind of really messed with you. So I feel like you, you have trust issues. So if you are dealing with somebody new, there is a bit of trust issues here because you're scared of getting hurt again. But Spirit's asking you to make the effort here. Because somebody, whether it be you or the new person, whatever the case may be, maybe they're a little standoffish. And remember, guys, this can be vice versa energies, okay? Yeah, some of you are trying to free yourself from any type of codependency. I feel like in the past, uh, past relationships, you were either uh, uh, relying on them, um, whether emotionally, financially. For some of you, definitely more emotionally. Yeah, um, somebody here from the past might want to make a turnaround. Um, I don't know if you're going to want to accept that or vice versa. Yeah, somebody here still has passion for you or vice versa. You still have passion for somebody. Now, Spirit's telling you to wait. The right person will come along. Yeah, double confirmation, wait. It's all about waiting. Yeah, for some of you, there's definitely, there was a separation here, or there will be. For those of you who are already partnership or are, um, this is past energy here, the separation. Now I'm going to get tarot, and the tarot, um, it's not going to be directed towards love. Um, it's going to be in, in any dynamic, okay? But if love comes out, we'll talk about it. <laughs> Oh my God, you guys, I keep getting, the theme of this reading is patience, patience, patience. We got temperance, just little patience. Yeah, yeah, definitely. So I do feel something coming towards you. You need to have patience, slowly testing the water, slowly getting your feet wet here. Yes, everything is in divine timing, okay? 
and I feel like you will succeed. You will reach some sense of happiness. Uh, for some of you, if your finances aren't doing well, I do see uh, them getting better here. For some of you, the right person is going to finally come along. There could be a family dynamic here. There could be children involved. You can have children as well. Yes. A fresh new start, a fresh new beginning, an opportunity here. Um, this is also my um, like down payment card. So some of you might uh, be purchasing something. Uh, some of you might be making a down payment on a car, a home, moving. Um, and if it's not something attainable like money, it could be you sowing a seed. Like I told you, if there's something you wanted to get off the ground, and I just felt uh, for a lot of you, it's more like work situation. Maybe you starting your own business, starting something new here, and it's taking a while because of everything that's going on in the world or whatever. Um, it's like you're sowing your seed and you will uh, get the fruits of your labor. It's just taking some time, but you will. This is also my beauty car. For some of you, uh, you guys might be um, doing something new aesthetically. Maybe you're changing up your hair, your makeup. I mean, Pisces are super creative, the most creative ones of all the zodiac. So I see you changing up your hair, different hair colors, uh, the makeup, maybe starting a new diet exercise, like a uh, routine, I'm sorry, and uh, eating differently incorporating more fruits and vegetables some of you may be dabbling in becoming vegans vegetarians whatever the case may be but i do see you doing something different something that's making you feel good some of you practicing that self-love here excellent Yeah, there is going to be some sort of justice here so if anyone wronged you or vice versa rest assured that karma is here there will be a balancing some of you could be dealing with a libra I feel like somebody, you might be in stagnation mode. Somebody in the past might have just left you hanging. You might be viewing someone as a traitor. Yeah, and you just had to put the burdens down, burdens down with them. You might have cut somebody off or vice versa. There was an ending of some sort. Thus, new beginnings. And then we have the Wheel of Fortune, guys. Everything is in divine timing, like I told you. Uh, the wheel finally changing in your favor. Uh, entering a new phase of your life of happiness. This is excellent. We have the death here, which is great as well because with death comes what? New beginnings. So this could also be a Scorpio of significance as well. It doesn't have to be clearing out the old to get rid of all that bad stuff and going back into the sun here, finding your happiness. Because something or someone might have uh, left you feeling very betrayed, stabbed in the back, hurt feelings. But there's definitely healing from this. I do feel like you're going to heal from this. With tens again, endings, new beginnings some new fresh opportunity coming towards you or this could be a person as well sorry guys my lip rings kind of get in the way of me talking <laughs> so I'm going to get some other shells for you now Uh, yeah, somebody here definitely wants to make a return towards you or this could be a situation making a come around. Um, I don't know if you're going to want to accept this. For some of you, I feel like it's definitely a no. Been there, done that. I'm also picking up, again, like I said earlier, not now, not now. There will be some kind of surprise coming towards you. However, I do feel like this is going to be a good surprise. I feel aqua heavily, heavily here. Some of you could be cusp aqua pisces cusp some of you could be messing with an aqua you can have in your chart they can have in your chart uh this can also indicate healing like we spoke about a wish coming true like we spoke about as well somebody here is sorry about a situation this could be you or the other person i'm also picking up traveling some of you might have to travel might be at a distance from somebody um if you met somebody new maybe you guys live in a different city different town maybe you met them online um or if not you could feel just kind of um if that's geographically feeling distant, you could just emotionally be feeling distant from somebody. <sighs> yes, heavy, heavy aqua energy here. Are you guys messing with an aqua? Let me know. Uh, yeah, I do see something to do with work. Um, yeah, I got he work heavily earlier as well with the first shells here. So there could be something different with work here going on here. Um, there might be a bit of a blockage with work, but I do see a turnaround here. Okay, now I'm going to get the pendulum, guys. So um, I want you to meditate over a yes or no question, and then I'll give you your answer, okay? So I'm going to give you a second. Ready?
Oh, can you see? I'm sorry. So I'm getting this as a yes. So awesome for you guys. Um, okay. Now I'm going to leave you with some oracles. So full disclosure, guys, these do have bat words. I hope nobody gets offended. What does Pisces need to know? What does Pisces need to know? Whatever you are thinking about, don't do it. And it's in reverse. So I feel like you should do it. <laughs> uh, now is not the fucking time. Oh, well, like I said, divine timing. <laughs> you should do it, but just not now then, I guess. You are talented and fucking amazing. Of course, you're Pisces. The world needs your power. Use your voice. Just don't use it for dumb shit. So I also feel like some of you might be uh, like musicians or do something, maybe speakers, writers, something like that as well. You are the best thing that ever happened to you. What did I tell you about that self-love? Go easy on your ass. Buy your own damn drink. You do you, boo. Stop trying to change people. That shit never works. Fuck fear. It will lie to your face. So yeah, if you guys are scared about moving forward with whatever plans you have, don't be. Just go for it. Get some fucking sleep. So some of you, your sleep pattern might be off. Or you might be getting nightmares or something with your sleep here, dreams. Um, you are being an ass because you are fucking tired. Face to pillow now. <laughs> I'm going to get okay these and then I'll let you guys go. Perfect. We have full moon here for you guys. So ruled by Cancer, but moon also Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Wishes coming true, what did I tell you guys? Um, some of you could be dabbling in the arts or becoming more spiritual. Uh, I do feel like a sense of protection, which I did talk to you earlier about. You're being protected by the 5D harvest, so you will reap the rewards of whatever seed you sowed, okay? So this is my reading for you guys. I hope it was of help. If it was, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. I so would appreciate it, and as always, stay magical. Bye, Pisces.